with a similar issue because I was uh, uh one week ago I was grabbing the shit at the trash after after the podcast day, and this giant bug falls off of it, and I'm looking at this thing and it's like it's pretty big. It's a pretty big bug, and I'm like I'm looking at the the, the wings on the back of it. And I'm just like, is that a damn cockroach? Right? It was like. Like that that has a lot of the characteristics, but I don't think I've seen one in person. So I found I was same thing with the with the leaves. I was like, is there something that identifies just insects, right? And this is an ongoing problem as well because um, I'm told to kill spiders, and we are trying to figure out if they're ones that if they bite us, it'll be a problem. And now I can do that. So I found another app. And it's it's not it's not impressive of an app. It's it's got huge ugly ads on it and everything. But it's literally just called insect identification. <laughs> That's it. And it's got a a a, a, a ladybug on the cover uh, on the uh, app for it. Once again, took a picture of this thing and said, "No, it was some kind of beetle, some kind of crazy beetle that happened to be on the trash." So don't worry, you don't have cockroaches. Uh, so, uh, so, so that that's my awesome things is the fact that like like you can identify things like this if you're out in nature. Uh, uh, want to know what a bug is? Want to know what it, what the, the the stuff in your yard is? You know, uh, you can use it insect identification and plant snap uh, apps. And this is iOS, of course, just because that's what I have. I would imagine there's equivalents of these somewhere on um on Android phones as well. So um I don't know. Have you guys ever played with any of these or had any need to um um identify <laughs> insects and, 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 and plants out there? <laughs> 